And then, uh, again, I don't know what's official, but you might be joining the MCU in Fantastic Four. I've seen that reported as fact, but I never know if that's You fact. said this was a 90-minute... <laughs> Some people were even saying like, oh, is there like a, there's like a green right here. Is there a Dr. Doom presence right there? Finally, how many times did we hear from scoopers that, oh, we're going to hear about that Fantastic Four casting. It's right around the corner, right around the corner. That's right. Any moment now it's imminent. I know scoopers like to use that word imminent. It's like, yeah, of course it's imminent. Yeah, it's going to be... Yeah, you're just trying to save your ass. God, that's what I hate about scoopers. Any moment now. But at the same time, it was like, oh, we've talked about how, you know, Pedro Pascal is basically the cat's been out of the bag, but he couldn't talk about it. He got interviewed even recently at something where he couldn't even... He didn't even answer that. And he did a very good job of detouring the the question. And then, uh, again, I don't know what's official, but you might be joining the MCU in Fantastic Four. I've seen that reported as fact, but I never know if that's You said this was a (laughs) 90-minute... Okay, so it's not reported as fact. Tell the truth. (laughs) There's like the past 90 minutes. Uh, Like, well... By two minutes, but I have one... It is now confirmed that Pedro Pascal is Reed Richards. And, of course, we got Vanessa Kirby, Sue Storm, uh, Joseph Quinn as Johnny Storm, and then, of course, Yvonne Moss. But I, I, I'm, I, I can't even say his last name. But I know a lot of people were, were, were grateful for it because he actually is Jewish. And, you know, Mr. Grimm, Mr. Ben Grimm is actually Jewish right there. But, yes, they did a good job because now they are officially showing that, yes, This movie does not take place in present day. Well, first off, they got little Herbie right here, right? So they got their little robot. So that's interesting. Not to mention you got, look at how their costumes look. Their costumes do not look modern day. Neither does the setting for this Valentine's Day party that they're having doesn't look like that. And then, of course, we have Ben Grimm right here, you know, being an astronaut. So we know that, you know, yeah, of course... I mean, obviously not been to the moon or anything like that quite yet. But the biggest thing was the biggest thing right here was the Life magazine that he's that he's reading. There's the Life magazine right there that's drawn on there. Some people were even saying like, oh, is there like a there's like a green right here? Is there a Dr. Doom presence right there? But everybody was going like, oh, maybe it's this issue of Life magazine right here. That was in December 13th of 1963. So. Disgusting film does actually have it wrong right here. They do. They do have it wrong right here. Because if it's Valentine's Day and that issue came out in December of 1963, that means it is, in fact, 1964. But then we got the release date. We already talked about how Jurassic World was supposed to be coming out on July 2nd of 2025. And then, of course, what comes out on the 11th? Superman Legacy. So everybody was like, oh, yeah, there's that. Well, now... When we got that slate, when it came to the investors stuff, when Disney was releasing all the stuff that that happened last week, it was basically talking about like uh, May, it was May 5th, I think, or something like that when it came to Fantastic Four, but they pushed it to July 25th. They pushed it to July 25th. So if things like are current the way they are, we would get Jurassic World on the 2nd, we get Superman Legacy on the 11th, and then of course we would get Fantastic Four on the 25th. I don't think it's gonna meet that release date, Again, it's like they they just announced the cast. Superman Legacy is about to go into production. And then there was Thunderbolts that was also rearranged too. And that got bumped up to May 2nd. So I think that's actually what the Fantastic Four date was actually set at. So I don't know what the hell is going on with Marvel. It just seems like they're just like, okay, we're going to start shooting maybe. But apparently Fantastic Four is not shooting until summer 